Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Benjamin Magnus Plays RimWorld 1.0. Uh, last uh, time we started up with a little bit of a bug, but uh, now we're okay. It's all sorted. We're doing pretty good for our, our all-tribal cannibal start. I'm a little bummed that there haven't been more raids. I think maybe it's because I'm so poor, maybe I need to be richer to get some more raids, but we're working on that. We're working on that. We're getting some more stuff. Uh, last episode I spent working on a lot of storage things, so right now I built a, a series of shelves that are all set up right here to store good, basically the better quality weapons that I have, so that at a quick glance I can find the good weapons, and these are the shite weapons. And I might do the same thing, I could actually do, maybe do the same thing with clothes. You know what, I think I'm going to do the same thing with clothes. Mm, nah. Nah, it's kind of, it's, it's mildly already set up. For, to that point, to uh, uh, slightly to that extent. Right now I have this new dumping zone over here where I just told him to put all of the shitty clothing. So once the shitty clothing is dealt with... Um, actually, that's probably everything. Yeah. Anything less than 50% is just automatically dumped over here to rot. I don't feel like wasting time burning it, and I think I might need to hunt these elephants because I keep putting them in my goddamn way. I did tame one, though, which is pretty sweet. Um, he doesn't have as high as an intel- I can't, like, ride him in the battle, which would be fucking amazing. Imagine, imagine, like, elephant lancers. You know, put them in plate armor with, like, a spear. And then put them on elephant back, and then, oh, elephant armor! Oh, there needs to be a mod for all of this things- all of these things to make it happen! Oh, that'd be great. But anywho, that's, uh, that's a pipe dream. That's a pipe dream. Val, soul, really? What, 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 what do you want to do? Crafting five. Are there really no crafting tasks to do? Well, mm, he's on crafting, but not... I mean, it's the same thing. No, wait, wait, no, wait, 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 wait. Soul, 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 soul. Set to Taylor. You know what, we'll just put him on... Yeah, it's, it's all the same. So, uh, this is the Taylor bench. There's nothing really... No, there's stuff... Oh, we might not have enough material. Mm, yeah, I didn't think about that. What I was thinking about doing is is what might be a nice idea would be to go out on raiding expeditions um, and attack enemy camps and kill people and then haul them back for food. I thought that would be a lovely thing to do with my time. I see nothing wrong with that. Also, what I'm going to do is have people go out and start collecting more um, resources as we find them. I know there's some stuff like, look at the size of this steel vein right there. That just seems huge to me. This whole thing, that thing there, heat wave, that's not ideal. Make sure that it stays nice and cool. I mean, this area should be fine. It's nice and insulated. It's good in here. 36, ooh. I think I might need another AC unit. As this, especially now that it's getting 60 plus degrees outside. And a flash storm. Well, I mean, there's not much that can burn. As long as it doesn't hit the crops, I'm fine. Dromedaries can be used as pack animals. I don't think elephants can. Let's see. Nuzzle interval. Oh, that's cute. Thought that'd be higher. Let's see. Trainable advanced. Oh, they can. Oh, never mind. Fuck it. Elephants can be used as pack animals. I didn't think they could before. Maybe, maybe I was wrong. I could have sworn I, I checked that before and I don't remember it being a thing, but they definitely can now, so there's that. Yeah, I mean, they're, these AC units are, are working overtime and, and not getting the job done. What I could always do is put more in here. Or I could space them out a little bit. And an eclipse. That's not the end of the world. We have diversified power generation. That's a collapsed rock over there, huh? So that's cotton, that's the hay grass, the meds. 
the rice and the corn. It's a it's a good uh, you know diversification of of our gro our, our growth speeds and goods too. Uh, we're doing well on food. I mean, it's almost in, for for cannibals being almost entirely vegetarian. That sucks. Probably no oh, no. Anybody having nope no heat stroke yet? Uh, I think I will have them. Here, let's just do it like this. Let's see if that works. Just because I like symmetry and I don't want to have to like knock on another sectional wall here. I just really like symmetry. Is there any way we could have finished one before? Whatever. You do you guys. You do you. It's gonna be hot in there. Yeah, it's very hot. All right. So set this down to 18 as well. Set this one down to 18. Let's see how that does. Four AC units just cranking into this main hallway and then venting into the other areas. We'll see dirt for the heat wave how they do. Drug production! Huzzah! Go juice. Uh, I don't think we need this. I m mostly got that so we can get medicine production down here. Beer would be great. I think beer would be nice for us. Those are wood stores. Not bad right now. For, for this colony? Not bad. Oh, elephantopus. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, I love his big elephant butt. Don't poop in the rooms. It's getting better. It was 66. Oh my god, it's almost 70 degrees outside. That's a hell of a heat wave. How much is that in how much how much of that is in dumb in dumb American units? That's got to be like almost enough to kill you. I mean, well, any temperature will 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 well most they're, they're, like any temperature high or low will kill you if you stay out in it for the enough time. So it's uh let's say 70 times 1.8 plus 32 I think is the math. That's almost 160 degrees Fahrenheit. So it's Animal Starvation, James the Husky. He doesn't, he, he'll have to come and eat a meal. Oh yeah, that's better. It's getting down in the 20s now at least. Most, probably mostly because of the, uh, the, the, the night time. It's cooler outside. So it's okay inside. Learn how to brew some beer. Thinking machining would be good next. Electric smelting, electric cremation, geothermal power. That would be amazing. That's a ways off, though. We got this geothermal vent right here we can have easy access to. I always like to think about the geothermal vents when I'm making my base. I knew that one would be easy to block off, so... Oh, we figured out how to build bridges, right? I don't know where that would be. Bridge. Build non-heavy structure on bridges, but to be careful, bridges are fragile. Ooh. Bridges are fragile. If a bridge falls, buildings on top will fall as well. Kind of wanted to just... See. How wide do we want this? Kind of want to just make it straight. You know what? Uh, cancel this. Again, we will do it down this way. So, one, two, three, four... I mean, what I'll do, I just want, I just want this bridge to be straight, and then I'll take this out, and we'll deconstruct. Uh, is it gonna be remove bridge? There we go. It's a separate thing. There we go, like that. Take it 
take this section out, put this section in, just so that bridge is nice and straight because that, I mean, it makes the road look a little janky, but other than that, it's okay. And then we'll go, let's see, security, sandbags. And let's see. The sandbags need to be like on, we'll put sandbag sections on each side. They're not gonna be even, unfortunately. But put sandbag sections on each side so that we can put people in there. If people, if someone's crossing. I was thinking about putting some more on the other side as well, but that's better than nothing. When it comes to defenses, something is always better than nothing. I put, put through around some deadfall traps. Steel ones, I think, are the, the best ones to see. Uh, 60 damage. Marble. Yeah, the stone ones are a lot less. Let's see what about wood? Those are probably even less. Yeah, so steel is by far the best. Hmm. Let's do it like that. That's going to be a lot of steel. And the idea is that anybody... That they either have to filter in through here, giving me better shots at them, or they cut through and hit the hit the traps. I did have people working on steel, though, so... Well, we still got a bit. I mean, it was 70 per, and I, I put down, like, 24 of them or something like that. Maybe, maybe more. Between 25 and 30. Maybe less than that. I don't know. It's not that bad, really. So anybody crossing the bridge is going to have that issue. Or they, ju or they just say, fuck it, and uh, they have to walk through the, the deep sections of the, well, the chest deep moving water, which walks me to 22%, which helps. No matter what, we got it. Uh, we got a good section there. Um, and what I, I could do is rip up this because it's got a walk speed of 100. This is walk speed of 76. So I'm going to take that out. And then I'd probably lay down more, you know, you know, lay down more paved tiles on my side. Ideally, you want my side to be able to walk fast on. Bums me out a little bit that it's not even. Oh, what are you going to do? This is a great space for some gunners or some turrets. Some defenses. I like it. See, that's why they call me Magnus Some Defenses. I got about a few. Yeah, good job, Val. I'm going to walk out there, hit it twice, then I'm going home. Ayo, Bino and Soul playing a board game. And I was going to put clothing in here, too, but then I decided not to. Right. Okay. All right. I like the bridge better. I, I definitely like the bridge, you know, in this on a straighter, straighter section like that. Heat waves over. Thank Christ. We did have enough steel to finish up those traps. Probably could have done it better, but I think that'll work okay. What do we got? Uh, some goop. We got we got, we got a bit of goop. Power's good now. We're not using. We don't really have a a large power drain though, so it's not that big of an issue. All right, machining will be nice because then I'll be able to get. I mean, mortars, prosthetics would be... Ooh, uh, prosthetics, bionics. I love that prosthetics and bionics are base game now, and you no longer need a mod. Let's see. Um, I was going to do some smoothing. So I think there's... There's a little bit of smoothing to do over here. Cancel this one up here, though. Don't need that, because they can't get to it. And everything's... Oh, that's bad. 
That's real bad. Uh, the AC's off. It's gonna get mighty cold in here. And by mighty cold, I of course mean mighty hot. They come around them, that's good. Hmm. Oh, they're working on the steel. That's good. Replenishing all those steel items I lost. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we got a couple days before this stuff starts to go bad. The rice and the corn should be fine. The jelly should be fine. But those cooked meals won't be. Cool. Guada's got mad. We're gonna start doing a little hunting here. You guys got this. There you go. those animals for hunting take out those camels oh, they'll provide us some good meat you know what I could also do to save space is put a you know put a storage space outside it doesn't, like a lot of this stuff doesn't need to be inside there we go some delightful dromedary meat Jeez, Val. Val Val and Revy murder I made him not I named elephant one Ebenezer. Oh, that's a cute name. Ebenezer elephant. Ebenezer elephant. I love him. Okay. Hoping. Oh, did the solar flare end? Yep, it already ended. So we're fine. It was a short one. Not a not really big issue. Uh, I am gonna go ahead and do another stockpile zone. Outside, uh, we're gonna put it right here. This one is gonna be all preferred and buildings, chunks, stone chunks, steel slag chunks, uh, manufactured. Is it in here? I'm looking for uh, blocks, stone blocks, steel. That'll free up a lot of space in the storage area because that stuff doesn't need to be inside. Oh, there's some more steel right here, isn't there? Nice. Magnus, how you feeling these days? Table, tainted flak vest, slept in the heat. So these rooms are good. Nice in here. These rooms are good. Mag Magnus's room is... Oh, Magnus' room is does well. It's not that bad. And quit your bitching. Oh, Magnus is back to crafting. It's a hat. It's a fine hat. All right, cool. Smooth that stuff out. Not not a real reason for that. Just just so it looks pretty. It all looks nicer. We really went through the. Uh, the hay a little quicker than I expected. Um, elephant probably eats a lot, but should be okay. I could always increase the um, the size of the uh, this growing area or make another one. Magnus is now that we're not wasting all of our time on those cacti. Magnus has got more time to work. You know what? Um, I'm going to make more growing zones, and we're just going to start down. Ooh, nope. Start right here. We're going to go. I don't know why we're doing seven by sevens, but we are. And I'm squaring them up as best I can. We're going to do another hay grass. And uh, let's see. Strawberries? Smoke leaf? Hops? Make beer? Yeah, let's do a little bit of hops. Do another thing of hay grass for the animals. I mean, we might be okay, but I don't like running out of food for my animals. I love animals, and I hate to see them. Even in this game, I hate to see them starve. Put down the hops. Soon, uh, we're gonna need to move on to a new bench. Oh, he needs a... You know what? That would be nice, is to actually get, get a chair in here. Dining chair. Made out of wood. 
I don't know if we need any more of these. No, I think we took care of them in all their places except for right there, but we're not really using that too much, so not a huge issue. Once we get some cotton done, we'll actually be able to make some better entertainment areas, and we'll need a rec room. What I could do is take this entire section out. Ooh. Um... Take some of this section out. We have to leave like a area because make this too much bigger. It's gonna collapse. Mine this out. Actually, you know, what? I'm gonna go ahead and let them do that and tell them to do that now. Mine this area out. Extend a wall over. Have a rec area in here. Maybe uh, move. Or what we could do is move the um, production over that way. That'd be a good idea. We'll we'll, we'll preemptively take care of some of this stuff. I think we extend this wall out to maybe about there. Make another big room here. Leave pillars for support or uh, put doors in there so that they're actually separated. I think that'll work out good. They got a lot of, a lot of mining tasks to do right now, but it's not super high priority, so I'm not going to stress out about it. I like the idea of making some beer, though. Love a good beer. So that'd be under production. Brewery. So we need the brewery and the fermenting barrel. Maybe several fermenting barrels. And those are... Oh, work frenzy. Hey, Magnus. Yeah, get to work, you bastard. Watch him plant like a madman. Jesus, yeah, look at that. Please don't tell me the only thing he's got left to do is... Yep. All right, so... we As long as we've got that... So let's make a couple long swords and have Magnus work on them. Grab some steel, make some long swords as long as you're working like a madman. Yeah, go, go. Go skills up. He gets up to eight, and we're almost at seven, so. If we can get that up to eight, he can make the plate armor and we can have some medieval freaking knights out that steel that was in there too which is nice I can actually tell them you know what is this is as long as they're doing it might as well to tell them to prevent them uh you know get on this get on this shit right now we could take out that, that and then we can take out a lot of this stuff too that'd be a nice little area to work with uh we'll need a door in there because this is going to be a um steel auto door right there it's going to be a pretty active area. Maybe we continue a wall over like this, square it off a little bit. Nice big area to work with. Could be a, could definitely move all of our production over there. Huge, de definitely big enough for that. Did Magnus finish his sword? I think he did. Because that's a long sword. Wow, did he really do two? Or maybe we already had one. They're crafting up to eight. <laughs> I don't know how long. I, mean, I don't know if it was for one item or for a while. No, it was work frenzy, so it was increased work speed. So it was definitely for a period of time. I don't know how long because he did a whole bunch of planting. If it was just one item, he would have finished like a crop and then been done. What are the like like what are, can we compare? Oh yeah, there's another steel longsword. Let's see, seven point five. Um, damage per second, uh, a gladius. So it is, it is more. Man hunting pa uh, of chinchillas. We have a man hunting pack of chinchillas coming for us. Man the defenses, everybody! Animals. Oh, he could be a war elephant. He can be a war elephant. That is awesome. I just got some weep outside. Come at me, chinchillas, you fox. Oh, Magnus got shot. In the back. Uh, in the back of the neck. Whoa, a chinchilla bit his neck, but he got shot in the right hand. I think we're okay. Wait, one more! I 
hit a chinchilla with a shotgun. Okay. Everybody. Well, that's some delightful chinchilla meat. All right. With the attack of the chinchillas, I think we'll leave this as an episode right here. Thank you for watching, everybody. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you've been enjoying this series of RimWorld 1.0. And I will see you all next time. <laughs>